Welcome to the VPND News Update. My name is Gatang and the news in detail. A few days ago, a few weeks ago, we witnessed something that has never happened before. Two individuals were involved in a slapping incident. Will Smith walked up to the stage and slapped the rock in the face and I beg your pardon, I beg your pardon. Apparently, Will Smith walked up to the stage and slapped Chris Rock on the face. On the face, Val. <clears throat> we have our analyst in the studio who is going to give us an update on what we have learned from this incident in terms of uh, uh, how we are supposed to act as individuals, and also just how we're supposed to handle ourselves as individuals. Daddy Cook, over to you. My name is Daddy Cook, Shebjashime Kashnikov. I am sorry, my name is a little bit of tongue twist, so you can call me Daddy Cook. I am here not to give you information of what should have happened or what should not have happened, but I am here to give you positive lesson I learned from this situation. Chris Rock and Will Smith. I start from uh, Chris Rock. I start from Chris Rock. What lesson I learned from Chris Rock? Chris Rock, he gets slapped in the face. But what do he do? He no fight back. He stay on stage and he continues to deliver. What lesson I learned? Professionalism professionalism anyway he goes on a few days later he no press charges he no press charges because he not want to retaliate i he got reasons for not pressing charges anyway but another lesson i learned he apologizes now humility always takes you to a place where you realize if you've done wrong and then you apologize and the chris rook apologizes for making joke on the medical condition he not know i think he don't know but he make he make he make a joke and he apologizes for joke because of situation that happened afterwards and he say he is sorry for doing that professionalism humility now will smith will smith he upset will smith he's not happy about joke concerning his wife i must say her name her name out of my mouth but we see he upset and he stand up he walk up the stage and he slap chris rock in the face we understand later on he's protecting the one he loves now we don't condone violence but lesson you learn from that is protecting and standing up for one who you love in this incident he loved his wife very much and he stand up for his wife. The way he do about it, no, not so good. Slapping, not so good. But you stand up for who you love. Now, another lesson we learn. Will Smith, he cry. Will Smith, he go on stage, he accept his Oscar. He cry. Now, man, this is for you. It is okay to cry. If you feel emotion, it is okay to cry. Remember Jesus? Jesus, when his friend died, Jesus wept, Jesus cried. Women should be able to cry because we have emotion. So if you want to cry, man, cry. That is a lesson. Another lesson we learn from Will Smith. Later on, he apologizes. And he accepts consequences that would come afterwards. He know he got consequences. But he say he accepts the consequence. But he apologizes to Chris Rock. And he apologizes to everybody. He say he embarrassed. Humility. Yeah, now, you know, violence is not so good. I remember when Jesus Christ walked in temple and he find tables, people selling in temple. Jesus Christ tend the tables. He whip them. And he tell me, and he told them, you are making my father's house a den of thieves. He was protecting one he loved. I am just wondering hmm, how many lawsuits he could have been facing now. But that's beside the point. Lesson I learned, Chris Rook, professionalism.
humility. Will Smith protecting one he love. It is okay to cry. And lastly, back humility. Chris Rock, Will Smith, humility. With all that said, there's only one thing left to say. America has now added a new weapon to his arsenal. The slap. With all that has been said and learned, one thing we can now officially say is that the Zambian term Mbezi has now been given a sister name and it is Bawire. This is VPND News. I am Katanga.